بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم in the name of Allah most gracious most merciful we continue to complete our lectures about charging system now this lecture is entitled lecture number six charging system part number two of the subject automobile electrical and electronics for automobile engineering department stage number four College of Engineering and Research, University of Babylon. Electronic regulators use solid state circuitry to perform the regulatory functions. Electronic regulators can be mounted either externally or internally of the AC generator. There are no moving parts. So it can cycle between 10 and 7,000 times in a door, in a door, in a door, per second. This quick cycling provides more accurate control of the field current through the rotor. Pass with modulation controls AC generator output by varying the amount of time the field coil is. Energize. For example, assume that a vehicle is equipped with a hundred amperes generator. If the electrical demand placed on the charging system requires 50 amperes of current, the regulator would energize the field coil of 50% of the time. If the electrical system's demand was increased to seven. 50 amperes, the regulator will energize the field coils in 50% of the cycle time. يعني في كل دورة هنا استخدمنا نصف دورة. كل نبضة استخدم نصف دورة. والنصف الآخر يقوم داون. For every pass. The electronic regulator uses a zener diode that blocks current from flow until a specific voltage is obtained at which point it allows the current to flow. All the alternatives are all marked for electronic regulator. Computer controlled regulation on many vehicles after the mid 1980s, the regulator function has been incorporated into the power train control module, which is the PCM. The operation is similar to the internal electronic regulator. ربط البي سي ام بالفعل مع الاي سي جنريتر كمنظم فالانبوت يستخدم الاير كونديشنينج سيجنال وبريك سويتش سيجنال كولنت ايليد يعني الاوية جهاز التبريد او نظام التبريد والبريك سويتش سيجنال والتيك اير تمبرتشر سنسر حساسات الحرارة حساسات السرعة سبيد سنسر ستارتر سويتش سيجنال تي دي سي ترانك سنسر حساس الكرينك والبروتل اندل سنسر الذي يعطي الى البي سي ام اللي هو تسمى عقل الكتروني او المنظم الالكتروني والذي يعطي اشاره بدوره الى الاي سي جنريتور انديكيتر لايت اوبريشن از ديسكس ايرليير موست انديكيشن لامبس operate on the basis of opposing voltages. If the AC generator output is less than battery voltage, there is an electrical potential difference in the lamp circuit and the lamp will light. If there is no stator output through the diode trial, then the lamp circuit is completed to ground through the rotor field and TR1. On most systems, the warning lamp will be proofed. When the ignition switch is in the 
run position before the engine starts the indicators that the bulb and the indicator circuit are operating proper, properly proclaimed in the bulb is established because there is no stator output without the water channel. A meter operation in place of the indicator light some manufacturers install an emitter. The emitter is wired in series between the AC generator and the battery, as we saw in the figure 2. Both meter operation because the emitter is a complicated gauge for market for motion market for most people to understand. There are luminous many manufacturers use a voltmeter to indicate charging system operation. In early systems, the voltmeter is connected between the battery, positive and negative terminals. General Motors 10 SI series. SI series is a generator use an internal voltage regulator that is mounted to the inside of the slip ring and frame. There are three terminals on the rear end frame of the AC generator. Terminal number one connects to the field through one brush and slip link and to the output of the diode trial. In addition, the terminal is connected to a portion of the regulator and warning light circuitry. Terminal number two هي واضح الترمينال الصورة اللي فيه على اليسار صورة واضحة it's very clear to see the terminals number one and terminal number two terminal number two connect to the regulator to supply battery voltage to a portion of the regulator circuitry that sense has sensed system voltage يعني الانتاج الزائد من الامبيرية او الفولتية يذهب الى البطارية بشكل البطارية اثناء عمل الدايمو أو أثناء عمل السعر. Part terminal connects to the output of the stator windings as supplies the battery with charging voltage. Most SI series AC generators use a 14 volt motor identical on model. The stator is wired either in WYE or delta fashion to some way of the delta to cut off the star of the delta and we are about Models 10 and 12 use the WYE connection. All other models use the Delta connections. Here is a Chrysler, Ford, Mitsubishi, Toyota, and سيارات تستخدم بعض الأمن بها اختلاف وفي هذا نأخذ بعض الأمثلة السنة ليس كل الأمثلة باقي الأمثلة أيضا مطلوبة في موجودة في كتاب المنهج in your textbook الآن نرجأ بـ Chrysler IC Generators early Chrysler IC Generators يعني عند السكامة مبكرا تستخدم تيوز سيبريت هيت سينك يعني المبردات تستخدم سيبريت هيت سينك for the positive and negative diodes. Both these things are attached to the rear and frame. Also, the brushes are attached to the exterior of the end frame. This allows for brush replacement without having uh, dis assembled the AC generator. In fact, the brushes can usually be replaced without having to remove the AC generator from the vehicle. The three terminals on the rear and the frame are connected as follows. Path terminal connects the stator up with the battery to supply charging for voltage of the terminal. There are two field terminals. Battery voltage is applied to one of the field terminals. The regulator connects to the second field terminal. In 1985, Chrysler produced a Delta Volt dual output computer for home charging system. In the recent year, Chrysler used uh, Elgon 
Acer or Bosch Bolt AC generator that has AWYE, who are the module, on stator. This system also uses a DC and to control voltage regulation by varying the field winding ground. Vehicles equipped with next generation controllers, NGC and next generation controllers, have high side control. Example of IC generators, Mitsubishi AC generators, some Mitsubishi AC generators use an internal voltage regulator, figure below. It also has separate WYE, the whole of the connected stator windings. Each of the stator windings has its own set of six diodes for rectification. Come as that now, rectification diodes, uh, rectification. يعني تستخدم بالتحويل من التيار الـ AC إلى الـ DC لأن السيارة أو الماكينة أو الآلة لا تستخدم التيار الـ AC لذلك يجب تحويل التيار الـ AC إلى التيار الـ DC لأن الترميتر تولد التيار الـ AC The AC generator also uses a diode trial to rectify stator voltage to be used and the field windings. The three terminals are connected as follows. The terminal connected connects the output of both stator windings to the battery supplying charging voltage. R terminal supplies 12 voltage to the regulator. R terminal connects to the output of the diode prior to provide rectified stator voltage to design circuits. Another method that Mitsubishi uses for charging control involves a single WYE generator with an internal regulator that interfaces with the PCM. Brushless AC generator. Some manufacturers have developed AC generators. وهو الاقتصاد سام لكن الان الصور الاغلبيه او الكل تستخدم البرشلس اي سي جينيريتورز حتى لا تحتاج الى صيانه او تبديل لفتره طويله المولد او الداينو سام ماني اوف تشارلز هاف ديفلوب اي سي جينيريتورز ذا دو نوت ريكواير ذا يوز اوف برشز اور سليب رينجز ان ذيس اي سي جينيريتورز ذا فيلد ويندينج اند ذا ستيتر ويندينج ار ستيشنري a screw terminal is used to make the electrical connection. The rotor contains the four pieces and is fitted between the field winding and the stator winding. The magnetic field is produced when current is applied to the field winding. The air, gun, the air guns in the magnetic path contain a non metallic ring to divert the lines of force into the stator winding. The ball pieces on the rotor concent uh, concentrate the magnetic field into alternating north and south poles. When the rotor is spinning, the north and south poles alternate as they pass the stator winding. The moving magnetic field produces an electrical current in the stator winding. The alternating current is rectified in the same manner as in conventional AC generators. Hybrid electrical vehicle charging system, also called HEV, as was discussed before, HEVs utilize the automatic stop-start feature to shut off the engine whenever the vehicle is not moving or when power from the engine is not required. Some hybrid electrical vehicle systems use a starter, a starter generator unit to perform both functions. The difference between a motor and a generator is the motor uses two opposing magnetic fields. 
fantasy in another thing is this one magnetic field that has rotating conductance. The use of electronics to control the direction of current flow allows the unit to function as both a motor and a generator. There are two basic designs of the starter of the starter generator. The first design uses a belt alternator starter, or also called bus, that is about the same size as a conventional generator. And the industrial generator Ladia is mounted in the same way. Why land turbine is The second design is to mount an integrated starter generator. As we discussed before, we have shown in the first starters, which is the first one that is the self. Integrated Starter Generator ISG, even at either end of the crankshaft, on the of the crankshaft, most designs of the ISG mounted at the rear of the crankshaft. Between the engine and the transmission, the ISG is a three-phase AC motor that can provide power and torque to the vehicle. It also supports the engine when the driver demands more power, as seen in this figure. The ISG includes a rotor and a stator that is located inside the transmission bell housing. The stator is attached. To the engine block and is made up of two separate lamination stocks. The, st the rotor is bolted to the engine crankshaft and has four wire mount and permanent magnet sections. All hybrid vehicles that are capable of propelling the vehicle in an electrical only mode require HV batteries, the hybrid V batteries, vehicles batteries, to power the three phase AC motors. These batteries may have a capacity of over 300 volts. Many full hybrid vehicles have at least two AC motors located in the transmission or transaxle assembly to operate the planetary gear sets that provide constantly variable gear ratios. These motors can also be used as generators if the hybrid vehicle's battery SOC becomes too low, the engine is started and the crankshaft drives motor A to generate high voltage AC current. The current is rectified to DC voltage and sent to recharge the hybrid vehicle battery. Voltage generation can also occur wherever one of the motors slips. In most cases, one of the motors is slipping at all times. The slipping causes a cutting of the magnetic field and results in AC current. This current is used to supply electrical energy to the other motor. Regenerative braking about 30% of the kinetic energy lost during braking is in heat. When decreasing Acceleration regenerative braking helps to minimize energy loss by recovering the energy used to slow the vehicle. This is done by converting rotational energy into electrical energy through the, the IC, ISG, as we mentioned before, or ASC motors. Regenerative braking assumes some of the stopping duties from the conventional friction brakes and uses the electric motor to help slow the vehicle. To do this, 
the electric motor operates as a generator when the brakes are applied, recovering some of the kinetic energy and converting it into electrical energy. DC DC converter the AC voltage from the motor during regenerative or charging modes is uh, modes is uh, rectified by the inverter module. Since this module converts the high AC voltage into high DC voltage to recharge the hybrid vehicle battery, it can, cannot be used to recharge the auxiliary battery. An additional function of the inverter is that of a DC-DC converter. The converter allows the conversion of electrical power between the hybrid vehicle direct current system and the low voltage and V direct current system. The converter is a bi-directional. So in the state, DC converter, DC conversion device that charge the 12 volt system from the 300 volt direct current system. The converter replace the converter replaces the function of the engine driven generator while maintaining isolation of the hybrid vehicle system. The conversion of the hybrid vehicle to low V voltage is accomplished through the magnetic field instead of physical wire connections. Sets of the coils are used to accomplish the voltage conversion. The coils operate as a step down transformers to reduce the high DC voltage to the low DC voltage. By sequentially inducing and co collapsing the magnetic field, of the coils, a smooth output on the 12 volt side is maintained. Thanks for attention. Any question you can text me.